I leave my strips in the case and what I do is I hold a strip down and I pull a little section out and what happens is I arrange the sizes that I'm going to use on this little pad and that's how I pick them up. I never take my strips out. I don't put my strips on my hand. I don't put my strips on my client's head. I don't believe in that. So what happens is I pull out these little sections and I'll show you all what that looks like. So now I have this little group and I have them all separated and it 9, 10, 11, 12. And this isn't enough to cover her whole, her whole um, appointment, but I pull out about sections about this big at a time. And what happens is the reason why I love this um, technique the most is that these lashes are now I'm able to manipulate them on this lash pad with my tweezers and pick them up at a different angle. If I was pulling them off the strip only, I would have to only pick them up from the angle that they're on the strip. So sometimes that can get in the way when you're doing the opposite side of your dominant hand. What's great about this is I could pull up, pick up a lash and have it, I don't even know if you're gonna be able to see this. I can have it at, basically my lash can come in at this angle, my lash can come in at this angle, and my lash could come in at this angle, and I have a lot of control over what angle my lash is at, so if I'm doing an, a, a difficult inner corner or outer corner, I can actually manipulate that angle a little bit more. Mm -hmm.